Meditations for Every Day in Lent Saturday after the fifth Sunday in Lent The Good Thief The Gospel of St. Luke Chapter 23 Verses 39-43 to 43. And one of those robbers who were hanged blasphemed him, saying, If thou be Christ, save thyself and us. But the other, answering, rebuked him, saying, Neither dost thou fear God, seeing thou art condemned under the same condemnation. And we indeed justly, for we receive the due reward of our deeds. But this man hath done no evil. And he said to Jesus, Lord, remember me when thou shalt come into thy kingdom. And Jesus said to him, Amen, I say to thee, this day thou shalt be with me in paradise. Meditation on the Sacred Passion of Jesus Christ by Richard F. Clarke of the Society of Jesus Firstly Among those who mocked and derided Jesus were the two thieves crucified with him. But very soon his unspeakable gentleness and meekness touched the heart of one of the two. First, he ceased his words of insult. Then he boldly reproved his companion and bore testimony to the innocence of Jesus and to his authority as King and Lord. What a divine power there is in weakness, the sight of the uncomplaining patience of Christ convinced this robber that he was King of all the earth and that he who now was dying on the cross would soon reign for ever and ever. Lord, remember me when thou shalt come into thy kingdom. Secondly, remember me. This was his simple prayer, but we know that it was enough. If Christ remembers us, all will be well. What we have to dread is lest he forget us by reason of our having forgotten him. This prayer should often be on our lips. O oh Lord, remember me. In the hour of temptation, remember me. When sorrow bears hard on me, remember me. In sickness and in my last agony, O oh Lord, Remember me. Thirdly, our Lord answers this prayer of the good thief with divine generosity. All his sins are forgiven him, and as soon as his agony is over, he is to be received into the company of the blessed and to be with Christ in paradise. What a rich re reward for his confession of Christ. What a glorious answer to his prayer that Christ will remember him. A prayer of Saint Gertrude. O oh Jesus, mirror of that eternal splendor, remember now that sadness which filled thy heart when thou didst behold in the mirror of thy divinity, the reprobation of the wicked and the multitude of the lost. And by the depth of the compassion, thou didst then feel for lost and despairing sinners. And by the mercy thou didst show to the robber on the cross, saying, This day thou shalt be with me in paradise. I beseech thee, O compassionate Jesus, Show me thy mercy in the hour of my death. Amen.